comes up with a pretty steal. Curry for three. This fires from beyond the arc. Can't hold on to the ball. Good play. Gets the steal. Puts it in. Knocks down his first shot of the night. It's not enough just to beat your man off the dribble. You've got to finish the play with strength at the rim. Boy, they need to get something going here. And they call the foul. A reach-in called against Durant. The Celtics get to inbound. Ball knocked loose. Here's a steal. Here's the Eurostep. Oh, that's a few. Gets it to go. And the foul. Marcus Smart picks up his first personal of the night. Great concentration to finish the play and get the three-point play opportunity. Pinch, pinch, pinch. I got you. Able to hit the free throw, and it's a three-point play. Golden State is leading Boston by a score of 39 to 17. From three-point land, Irving shot from three-point land, no good. Boston's hoping to stop this run and stop it now, making the defense work with excellent ball movement. Quick passing around the perimeter. Knocks down the jumper. Stephen Curry, seven for 12 from three-point territory. And Brad Stevens calls a timeout. You're trying to slow down the opposition's momentum. I don't understand the timeout management here. You need to try to keep the game within striking distance. Instead, they allow him to go on this big run to run up this huge lead, and now they take their timeout. Irving on the drive. Rebound snatched by Durant. Though he telegraphed that pass, a bad decision. To Irving. The step back, nice adjustment, Curry the rebound. Thompson from downtown in the corner. Man, does he love that spot on the floor, Jeff. He does. He loves the corner three, Mike. Shortest three-point shot in the game, and he really has that great trait to knock it down. Horford's rejected. Quick move to get inside. This is at the rim. Hey, it's been one of those nights where nothing's been easy for them in the paint. Terrific team defense forcing that miss. And here's another look at that spectacular play. Lazy pass easily stolen by Hayward. Screen set nicely. Off the dribble. Straight to the basket and the score. Drive, drive, drive. That's the only chance you have of getting back into this game. Pass to the corner. Shoots for three. Stephen Curry with a nice dish. He's averaging six assists per game this season. He's got five points in this matchup. You don't have a lot of room over there in the corner. You got to get your feet set, get on balance, and stroke. Well, they saw it. A reach in. Called against Thompson. For three. In and out. That one halfway down. Couldn't have played that shot any better. Made it a much more difficult shot than if it was an open look. Stephen Curry is caught by the ref. Offensive foul. There's a steal. The two defenders converge. Pass to the corner. Thompson. And the Golden State Warriors make the three for two in a row. Nice follow through on that shot. Gets the three to drop. Back in his way down in the post. Horford for two. Shoots away. And Andre Iguodala, with his hand up, able to change the shot. And that was great defense to force that miss. He was right up in the shooter's face. Pass to the corner. Thompson for two. Let's it go. He's in rhythm now. 
an 8-0 run for the Warriors. Irving knocks it down. Pretty crossover. Strong move off the dribble penetration to finish at the rim. The pass is deflected, and they get the turnover. Nice pass to the basket. Flips it up. Can't connect from close range. Smart can't get that one to go either. He rattles it in. To Thompson. Looks to put it back up again. Thompson hits another two. Long-range pass. Dangerous pass, almost a steal. Curry the rebound. At the buzzer. Oh, it's good. And time expires here to end the first half. Golden State's up by 35. Coming up, Jalen Rose awaits with your halftime report. your EA Sports Halftime Report. The Warriors certainly didn't have a problem putting up points in the opening half. It was their playmaking, the way they gave each other scoring opportunity. That really impresses me. I love seeing unselfish basketball like that. These are the guys getting buckets for the Golden State Warriors. The Celtics. May be in the building, but they did not show up for this game. There isn't enough time to get into all of their problems, but I'll tell you this, they need to try to get better. These are the guys getting buckets for the Boston Celtics. Game track. Steals. Boston Celtics seem to be giving the ball away in this matchup like they're working for a charity. Too many times, they've given up steals, and the results have been terrible. They were worse with their ball control in the second quarter. Player of the half. Steph Curry was lighting up the scoreboard in the first half, and I'm not sure the defense will be able to figure out what it takes take to slow him down. He looks like he's in a zone. Let's have a look at the shot chart. Who was cold? Every player that makes it to the NBA is a great athlete. But even the best players have off nights. Today has just been one of those nights for this guy. Here we go with the top three plays. Number two. Number one. All right, back to the second half. I'll see you after the game. Welcome back to the Oracle Arena for the second half of this basketball game. Along with Jeff Van Gundy, Mike Green on hand. Golden State's dominant in the first half. Just can't miss from downtown. I don't see how they in any way keep this pace up. But they're not going to have to. They've built up such a cushion. They just got to play sound, solid basketball. their shooting drops off a bit. Into the paint. Great footwork off the dribble. Oh, nice rebound by Green. To Curry. 
Quick feed back. Fires away from downtown. Unable to convert the three. Stephen Curry, seven for 13 from the outside. Pass to the corner. He goes baseline. Just won't go from point blank range. Passes it back to him. Green. Thompson from three-point territory. And Clay Thompson with the three-pointer. He scored seven three-pointers in this game. Some lights out shooting. I have such admiration for guys who can consistently put the ball in the bucket. Got off to a great start and hasn't let up here in the second half. That's a three-pointer. The defense nowhere near him. In and out. It's just been one of those nights. Good open shots that have gone missed. It's a make or miss league. Unfortunately, tonight they've missed. Timeout call. And Gordon Hayward will get the inbound. Irving on the drive. Smart off the glass. Listen, you want to win in this league? You get points in the paint. You attack the basket. It gives you an opportunity to get conventional three-point plays, get to the free throw line. That's how you cut in to this deficit. As they bring it up, desperate for a score. Horford. Great pass. It's blocked. to Thompson, takes another one from downtown, and the Warriors make it from long distance, scoring another triple. I like that transition three. It's open, it's hard to guard, they're not matched up. That player can make that shot at a high percent. Strong rebound by Thompson. Curry puts it up from three-point land, and Stephen Curry with a pretty shot from three. I love watching great scores go to work. You look at the numbers he's putting up tonight, and there's no doubt that he'll be a top scorer in this league year after year. Irving against Durant. Oh, he loses it. Finds his space and takes the wide open three. The two defenders swarm. Curry jump shot. Able to put it in. He's 9 for 15 from the field. Good defense translates into good offense. Here, secure the rebound, finish your defensive possession, and then get out and go. Take the ball to the basket. Get an easy opportunity. Reward your hard work on defense. To Thompson. Green from beyond the arc. Smart, the rebound. Inside. Oh, he got hit, and they call it. Draws the foul, call against Iguodala. And Kyrie Irving will go to the line. Man, I thought that was going to be an end one. Good strength, just whipped out. So he goes one for two from the line after hitting the second. Curry. Curry from beyond the arc. Hits the three. He's got the stroke going now. He's among the lead leaders in scoring this season. Made the most of his opportunity and knocked it in. Three ball. Kicks it out to the perimeter. Nobody near him. Takes the three. Bang. Hits from downtown. He's one for three from the perimeter. You give this man time to set his feet. He's going to knock the three-point in time and time again. For the layup. And Kyrie Irving with a nice shot for two. This speed is hard to guard. Speed kills. Beats his man off the dribble and then finishes right at the basket. He curls in the paint. Count it. And the foul. And he'll get to shoot a free throw tonight for the first time in the game as he tries to complete the three-point play. That's great athleticism right there to finish with strength, absorb the contact, and earn your way to the line. 
One minute remaining in the third quarter. Golden State's up by 49. Horford to the rim. Banks it in. Sweet dish from Al Horford. When you play that good a defense and you contest the two-point J, you expect... Oh, he coughs up the ball with that bad pass. He loses control of it, and it's stolen. Boston's definitely needing a big-time defensive play on this possession. Green for two, puts it up, knocks down the shot. When you're playing with a big lead, your players cannot take possessions off. And I like the example that this unit is showing. Forcing a turnover and then not resting, not conserving energy, pushing the ball and getting a transition opportunity. Able to convert on both free throws. Green fires for two. Soft touch gets the roll. There's the switch. Attacks the rim. Straight down the middle. He puts it in. You want to keep attacking the basket and get layups around the rim. That's how you score consistently. To Curry. Forced to make the pass. Thompson helped defense trying to tie him up. Iguodala fires away. It's good. Gorgeous pass to the assist. And he just fires it up in the final seconds. Oh, no good. Third quarter in the books. Warriors up by 49. We'll have more Monday night NBA on ESPN after this break. Jeff, big lead as we start the fourth quarter. What's the key to wrapping this up quickly? Continue to breathe. This other team is a joke. They're showing no signs of life. All you gotta do is go out there and go through the motion. My goodness. Puts it in. He's in rhythm now. Hey, this is a results oriented business. I'm not crazy about that transition three, but it went in, and they got the hit they needed. Thompson, the rebound. Looking for consecutive three-pointers, and Gordon Hayward with a rebound. To the basket, and rolls in off the rim. They're down now, may not be able to come back in this game, but this type of basketball attacking the rim is what they have to do to play better in future games. Sloppy ball, and there's a steal. Curry from downtown. Yep, he hit a, a foul call against Irving. Golden State's four for four from the line. First free throw, perfect. And he gets the second. Perfect from the line, he hits all three of them. Golden State's leading Boston by a score of 95 to 39. Plenty of time, that's a three-pointer, that's good. He's two for five from outside. Can you say too easy? He is sitting there, open up the three-point line, and knocks it in. Corner three, it's almost a guarantee for him. I think there was a song, automatic, and it was automatic from the corner, Mike. Down into the lane, gets to the rim, gets the two, lucky roll. Excellent job of getting into the paint and finishing at the rim. To Durant. Tries to go for back-to-back -back threes here. Curry hits again. Back-to-back -back threes. And right from Jump Street, he has consistently provided the kind of offense that keeps his team on the winning track. To Thompson. Green. Green from downtown. Misfires on the three. Ball comes loose. Bad pass right out of bounds. Man, what a great game. 
the Celtics get the inbound. Smart choosing the screen, looking to get free. Irving. Irving for two with a force shot, and that's his sixth rebound of the game. To Thompson, there's the double team. Iguodala steps in, sets the screen. Slams it home for two. It looks bleak right now. You're down big in the second half, but these are the type of plays that need to be made if you're to cut into the deficit and get back in the game. Forcing the turnover and then initially pushing the ball right back at him and getting the transition basket. And he Euro steps his way to the basket. The Celtics with the offensive rebound to keep it alive. Horford with back-to-back -back baskets. When the ball's in the air, that's when the action really starts. If you're good, you're going to be rooting your man out so you can get that offensive rebound and stick it in. To Smart. Oh, a nice runner. Smart misfires again. Great contest on that shot, Mike. He had the shot timed perfectly to challenge and force the miss. Good solid entry pass. Smarts turned away. What a block. Tries to adjust the shot. Puts it in and draws the foul. Golden State 7 for 7 from the line tonight. Great concentration to finish the play and get the three-point play opportunity. Able to convert the free throw, and he completes the three-point play. Irving at the rim. No go off the backboard. They've been strong defensively tonight, but not right there. Right there, they were lucky when they missed at the rim. To the rim. He rattles it in. Raise your hand if you've seen this story over and over again tonight. Dribble penetration allowing the ball right at the basket. And Golden State's called for the foul. Their first team foul. And Gordon Hayward will get to inbound. Horford lends a hand. Irving fires for three. Not able to hit from beyond the line. Kyrie Irving's two for seven from long range. Curry, Curry fires away from downtown. And Stephen Curry with the jumper for three. An 8-0 run for the Warriors. The penetration and the drive straight down the middle and puts it home. It's not enough just to beat your man off the dribble. You've got to finish the play with strength at the rim. Half a minute remains in the game. The Warriors up by 58. Smart's looking to operate from down low. Ball loose again. Curry. Kicks it out to the corner. Gets it right back. The catch and fire away from downtown. The nice play, sinking the three. Sweet stroke, sweet result. Three point. Fires for three from the corner. Oh, so close, but no good. Golden State starting to relax a bit now as they've got this game clinched. They put together a nice win. And that'll do it. They win the title. Your new NBA champions. They won the ultimate game, a game seven in the NBA Finals to cap off what has to be thought of as one of the great years and one of the great teams in NBA history. They have so much to be proud of. They earned it. They deserve it. They won it. Give them all the credit. Game wrap up. The Warriors have earned the ultimate prize, an NBA championship. They faced adversity this season, but they didn't let them prevent them from achieving their dream. This was a series that will be hard to forget.
Check out the leading scores for the Golden State Warriors. The Celtics couldn't fight off elimination. It was a valiant effort, but they just couldn't get it done. I can already hear their fans saying it now. Maybe next year. What you see here is how the majority of the points were scored for the Boston Celtics. Game track. Steals. The Boston Celtics just couldn't seem to hold on to the ball in today's matchup. To be fair, their opponent deserves credit for some excellent defense. But I think their job was made easier for them. They gave up most of those steals in the first half. Player of the game. Steph Curry gets the award for the most obvious reason, and that's his scoring output. He couldn't be stopped, and it was incredible to watch. So, what kind of shooting was it? Have a look. Who was cold? Every player that makes it to the NBA is a great athlete, but even the best players have their off nights. Today was just one of those days for this guy. Here we go with the top play. Number two. 